what is that contraption? Is it a projector? Um, I say, I would say people, that's a really huge leap to make because, uh, people don't usually name their, uh, kids based off of the first letter of their names, but then again, uh, one of my middle names is Julia, um, and I was named after my mom's middle name, which, which is Joy, because it's Jewish tradition in our family, um, to, um, keep, uh, to, uh, name, uh, to, like, pass down names like that, but my, because my mom was like, well, I don't want to do the whole thing, I'll just do the first letter. That'll work, right? What's that sound? I forget which way we should go, like, first. But, uh, up there, if, if those, um... I still have that skull. I do, I didn't return the skull yet. I should do that. <gasps> yeah, if you get hit by those things, it's instant death. And, uh, that sigil stone, that sigil stone just, uh, prevented me from dying. I have three left, that's okay. I wasn't, I'm not gonna use them anywhere else. I suppose it doesn't matter if they hit me. Uh, we need to open all those doors before we do that. No comment? Okay. Wait, uh, sorry, bear with me. Um, my memory is kind of running out here. We should open this door at least. Close again. Our objective is to get through there, um, but we need to unlock that door first. There's no way to actually get there. Why did I do that? I'm so stupid.
where am I supposed to go again? Like, I, I don't think I'm supposed to go here yet, but I completely forgot. What did the... She can't get me here, even though it would, you know, be very easy for her to get me here. Might as well go give that guy his head back. So I don't I'll kill you! So I don't forget. Like, thank you for coming back. I was so bored. reason not to use that. Like, I'm almost done here. Come on, Alyssa! And, um, that was all the ghosts in the game. Yay!
get there. Okay, why was I finding this so difficult? Anyway... Oh, damn it. Okay, well, I, I do need to go the other way. Gotta unlock both of the doors. distinctly remember this moment. I should, at least, because a few years back, must have been a long time now, but I was playing this game. I'd played it before, and we had that earthquake in Virginia, and I was home alone, and I was 13, and I was very scared, <laughs> and I was playing this game. And I was like, what the hell? Is my controller rumbling or something? And then I realized we were having an earthquake. And I freaked out. And yet I still don't remember. Just a dress rehearsal. Now let the show begin. Lights, camera, action! How... How is it moving and screaming if it was stuffed? Alyssa! <laughs> Stop! Hey, I'll do anything! Anything! Oh, he is spineless. Give us your beating heart or else Dennis is going to be sliced and diced. <laughs> Forget about me! Run for your life! Run! Run! Dennis! Silence. Silence! What's it going to be? Leave Dennis or donate your heart to us? The clock is ticking. Look at him! We need an answer! Yes! What's it to be? It's in the shape of a heart. That's a nice detail. Back. I have to find another route. Book of Entities 5. The origins of Ralph. <laughs> His name's Ralph. Ralph and Jemima, the siblings who served Lord Burroughs, are unknown. Accounts relate that Burroughs picked them up on the battlefield or that they were brought over from the Orient. However, none of these stories are more than hearsay. The siblings were horrendously cruel by nature, and it is said that they were the torturers and executioners during Lord, Lord Burroughs' bloody campaign, showing a peculiar fascination for blades, and in particular, scissors. Even though they're not using scissors, they're using two blades. They found endless enjoyment in gutting, out, gutting or dismembering victims while still alive. When Lord Burroughs was finally killed, Ralph and Jemima were stoned to death by the crowds. Because both were possessed by the same entity, they were resurrected together and continued to wreak havoc as subordinates. That's kind of cute. Fits the style of this game. You know who they remind me of? 
um, the male and female, I don't want to spoil it, but there's one part of, uh, I forget their names, of, uh, the Adventure Zone, um, Balance, it reminds me of them. This looks just like Grandfather's Room, what is it doing here? Grandfather used to read to me all the time when I was little. Alyssa's drawings. For Grampy, today I read a book with pretty pictures. A wolf pretended to be Grandma and ate up a girl. It was scary, so I went to Grampy's room because Grampy would save me. Grampy is really strong and he can kill a wolf. I love my Grampy. I'm going to stay with him forever and ever. Love, Alyssa. Aww. Who would have thought? Is she being sarcastic now? Oh, look at look at all these drawings. Oh, so cute. I like the, like, uh, the top one, which is, like, a super detailed portrait. <laughs> and then these walls are just, like, regular photos. Burrows, my ancestor, hear me. I know of your pain and anger when you lost your beloved daughter Annabelle. Just before the ritual of engagement, my love for Elissa led me to kill her father, Philip. Entity was everything you're doing. Is it all because of you? Do you want me to resurrect Lord Burroughs after 400 years to unite us and to enact the ritual of engagement with Alyssa's blood? Is that what you want? Do you truly want me to stab my dearest granddaughter in the chest? <laughs> <laughs> well, that doesn't sound bad. Oh, no. <laughs> Once the deed is done, I will be with Alyssa forever. Return to this earth, Lord Burroughs. Join with me, and we will complete the ritual of engagement. Enter my body, and let our flesh be fused. <laughs>
everything, Elisa. <laughs> the one who's after your heart is none other than your grandfather, with the blessing of our own Lord Burroughs. <laughs> Once we have your heart, the two of them will carry out the ritual of engagement, and a new entity will be born. Thanks to you, our eyes will swell and prosper. <laughs> You wouldn't sacrifice the life of a friend just to save yourself, now, would you? Chop, 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 Just go through here again. Wait, what? Make it through a time? How? I guess I had to open the doors? Pendulum continues to swing in the background. It's a little different now. The the theme song. Victims twenty two. Sentenced to three hundred ninety six years. She doesn't have a very big health bar. Um, so this fight is really weird because for some reason they've decided that uh, they're no longer going to, or at least not for, uh, for this fight, they're not going to, to, um, they're not going to let you transfix her and they're not going to, um, auto aim. So you just kind of got to get into a corner and you gotta, like, aim by yourself, like, see, if I face the wall, I'm going to hit the wall. It's only for this fight. It's we really weird. Um, so you don't, you don't have to worry about transfixing her. You should probably run away from this. She's gonna go to a corner and she's gonna just, uh, do that.
So yeah, you're probably. Oh, she's so happy. It's kind of bullshit that she has less victims than her brother. Even though... Even though they executed together? It's like, 22 is all? I thought she was supposed to be like this big... murderer. And like, this is me trying my best. She has very little HP, so even though it's annoying, it shouldn't cause you too much trouble because the fight should be over very soon. Back to the real fight. 37 victims. Sentence to 820 years. So you do this, uh, this boss. That will follow you. It goes back to auto aim right here. So pitiful. No, I won't. I forget what that does. Says he's sorry, we can let him go. Really? 
You had to steal the show from her, didn't you? Aww. At least they're happy. In their evilness. you who saved me. I, something special. <laughs> what the hell was that? And please never do that again. <laughs> you destroyed all the subordinates. You think you're so clever, but you still have to destroy me. Uh. You want to save your mother. Come up to the top of the clock tower. I'm waiting. Grandfather. Grandfather? The real identity of the dark man. It's my grandfather. I have to go, Dennis. You stay here. Hey, wait a second. Don't treat me like a girl. I'm the man. Oh, fuck you. Man, you're not a ruder. I am. Hey, don't leave me, Alyssa. 